That's really well bowled. That is uh, quick and uh, very, very nasty. That's got to be close. Not out, says Steve Dunn now. Well, we'll have to look at that again. I'm just wondering if there's a little bit of bat. Yeah. Now, is that an inside edge onto the back pad? If it's not, it's very, very, very close. Let's have another look at this. Well, if that's not outside, inside edge. Oh, I think there is an inside edge there. And uh, that's what saves him. Otherwise, he would have been out. I think that's why there was a wry smile. <laughs> and a big shout. And they are convinced it's out. Steve Dunn has not moved. Now, Alan Donald can't believe it. Now... And if this ball didn't fall on the ground before it got to the wicket keeper, I don't see why that isn't out. It was well caught. It came off the bat angle. That is out. But I'm sure Mr. Dunn is feeling the, the pressure of all these criticisms that have been coming at him. That hit the glove really hard. No problems with the catch. That is out. No wonder Donald can't believe it. What next? Well, Bob Wilmer... His reaction to that decision. Inside edge, taking four runs. And uh, Aaron Donald is not impressed at all with this. Atherton and Donald had a few words when they were passing each other, but this man is really under pressure now. I'm not too sure if he knows exactly what to do at the moment, but what he's doing is saying not out for everything. And Donald venting his disgust at what's been going on. And he's banged this in and uh, he's just taken the opportunity to just have a few words with Mike Atherton. And, uh, that's probably a natural reaction, isn't it? Well, that was a catch again. Now Donald is really upset. He is now really upset and letting him give him everything. Lightning quick. Lightning quick. He's not amused out there. And that is a corker of a bouncer. It really was directed well. And this is uh, Test Match Cricket at its best. Up in the air. Now then, Paul Adams. Just out of his reach. Very attacking field in place. Adams now is going to be told to stay halfway back by Donald. And I think Donald thought that he got his man there. Atherton went for it. And it was out of Adams's reach. He had to run. He ran quick. He ran a long way. Just couldn't get there. Tell you something else, though, Mike. Whether we agree or uh, disagree on the events of the match, what is taking place here between Donald and Atherton is one of the most enthralling passages of cricket you'd ever wish to see. Atherton almost seems to have, uh, well, a kind of uh, masochistic instinct for situations like this, and Donald is so pumped up it hardly bears thinking about. And then what's that hit? It's given not out as well. This is uh, very raw out in the middle and mighty intense. Yeah! Dropped it. 
Mark Boucher has missed the big chance. Now. What a moment in the game. A pat on the back. The South Africans uh, are doing as they should. They're with Boucher here. A number have gone to him. This was very quick. What a great bit of bowling. Well, it's all happening. Beautiful bowling. Outside edge went very quick to Boucher. Not difficult. No doubt about that. He should have held on to that. Donald is not a happy chappy. That is for sure. And it's all action.